Welcome strangers and friends, it's Dell's Handheld Games. I've been away for a while but I'm back again and um, we're going to pick up where we left off with a pickups video and this pickups video is going to be a random mix of things and the first thing is Engage Games. Yeah, that's where we left off with the Engage Game look at. And I've picked up a couple more, so here we go. Tiger Woods PGA Tour 2004. Still sealed this one, debating whether to open it or not. Um, I'm kind of normally sitting on the side of the fence that says you should open your games. Um, they're there to play, but I'm um, not a big golf fan, I suppose, overall, so... I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do, but let me know in the comments if you think I should open it or not. Maybe I'll do it on the channel. And the other game is Crash Nitro Kart, but before we get to that, we'll have a look. I was going to open this, but I can't, can I now? Look an idiot. <laughs> um, yeah, let's look at this. Crash Nitro Kart. Um, three plus. Yeah, what I was going to do is open the that game, but I can't. Uh, the cart is in my engage at the moment. Um, nice colour manual there. Don't see those these days, do we? Crash hits the track in his most fast-paced adventure yet. Good game, this. Played it a little bit. Um, yeah, very pleased to get those two. Now quickly on to a Switch game. Balan Wonderworld by Square Enix. Yeah. And some more games, this time for the Evercade. Evercade Pico Collection 3 with 40 winks on. The C64 collection. And this might give you a clue as to one of the pickups. The IRM Arcade 1 collection. Now this comes with the Evercade XP, which I finally got around to getting. So, um, will be a video on this at some point. I'm not going to open it now. Obviously I have opened it, but, um... Not going to do an opening or a proper look at now, but great item to have. Also picked up this Tamagotchi. Tamagotchi. How do you pronounce that? I'm not sure, but um, nice. They were a big craze in the late nineties, weren't they? Um, didn't end up getting one then. Tried to get one, but couldn't. Um, but I've got one now. Transformers. Robots in disguise. Transformers Generation 2. This is one of those Tiger, Tiger Electronics games. We all remember these from the 90s, don't we? I didn't actually have one or don't remember having one, but a lot of people did. Um, LCD game. Probably won't ever open that, but I'm starting to collect these. Occasionally I've got the Sonic one. And now a couple of handhelds. My life. Another life in your hands. This is a, a handheld. I won't do a separate video on. This is a Goal-centric handheld. We do handhelds for everyone here, of course. Um, this is quite an interesting little unit. It's kind of like there's one game only and it's very similar to the kind of Sims games you got on the Game Boy Advance. Got these little cartridges for it. 
rather than being games, they're like accessories and things that add something to the main game. So that's an interesting idea. And finally, um, for the pickups, this retro pocket games thing. Um, I did have one of these, but I lost the back of the battery compartment. Um, but now I've got one box, so nice little thing to have. An orb unit, but might have a look at that in another video, I'm not sure. And um, finally, what I got um, in the post a week or so ago from my good friend Nandy, whose birthday it was, just was, um, from UK Crowd Gaming, I got this Digiblast. Now you might have seen the video he made when he said he was going to send me this, and yeah, I've got it now. Excellent. I'll probably do a video on this as well one day. Um, yeah, it's the SpongeBob one. Yeah, excellent. Okay, so quite a few little bits and pieces today. Um, if you like that video, like and subscribe. And um, I'll see you on the next one.